Kikilicious, I know I look an absolute mess because I don't have any makeup on, but it is quite all right. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna beat my face and everything. But I just wanted to come to you guys with a video. I recently just picked up some lashes, and I've been trying out um, individual lashes, but. It, it was difficult, like, I'm not gonna lie, because it was my very first time doing lashes. I found this pack in this um, Korean beauty store that was, like, inside my PX. So, these are the um, INV lashes by Kiss in the trios. So, I believe these should be a whole lot easier to, um, a whole lot easier to apply since they come in threes and they're not singles. It comes with a um, glue pocket and I think that is just the most coolest thing because when I was doing my um, my individuals, I kept having to put it on like random pieces of paper, this side or whatever, and the glue would dry up so fast. So I think having a glue pocket with some depth would be really good. So this is what the lashes look like up close. It didn't come with any glue, so I had to buy the glue on my own, but that's okay because this is a bigger bottle than the one that came with my individuals, and that is just fine. And this is the um, Kiss Eye Envy, so it is also with that brand. Um, it is Jet Black, which I should, which should be good because um, it, the other ones came with clear, and they and that dries like white, and I don't, I don't care for that, so... So yeah, those were the lashes themselves. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just do my makeup and I'm gonna come back to you guys applying the lashes. So right here, you see that I've already done my makeup and I'm just gonna take the eyelash glue and dump it into the handy dandy glue pocket. Ignore that little spill. <laughs> I'm taking the first medium trio and slightly placing it into the glue, not drenching it. I don't wanna drench it because um, you don't want all that clumped up glue on your eyes. So I'm just placing my first trio and putting it onto my eyelash with these um, very small tweezers I had from my last individuals. As you see, I'm using the tweezers themselves to kind of push back the lash um, and to get it as close to my eyelid as I can get it. Don't get it on your eyelash. They stress that to you in the packaging and also in other videos. And right there, I'm just checking out the progress. I'm alternating eyes. I'm not doing um, one eye at a time simply because that's just the way I do it. I'm going to be taking mediums all throughout um, my eye until I get to the inner corner. That's when I'll do um, the small lashes. So I think I'm doing a pretty good job right here. I'm um, just pressing it in, making sure it's all set. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> So I'm pretty, yeah, I'm getting pretty happy right here. So I did have to switch up the tweezers. Um, I'm using my red tweezers that kind of have like a wider tip to place them in. Now don't let this edit fool you guys. Like I was really getting frustrated. So they like they didn't want to cooperate sometimes because the um what like what is that on that um eyelash like piece of glue floating. <laughs> But they didn't want to like cooperate sometimes like the lash will get stuck to the tweezer and it was like really frustrating but i'm keeping my composure in this video i just had to make it aware like it was not perfect trust and believe it was not but <laughs> as you see right there but with um just time i guess that's really the most significant part of this i had a lot of time to do this i was kind of pressed because i did have somewhere to go and i was on my way somewhere but you know i felt like these were gonna be faster and they were to apply so i'm just placing them once again just the same way back at it with the smaller tweezers um i found that it's good to have more than one type of tweezer for these see right there that lash is just being so annoying but <laughs> all the less it was still way easier to apply um to apply than individual lashes as you see right here these are the finishing results pretty happy pretty happy with those <laughs> So right here, I'm finishing up with the Sally Hansen Eyelash Curler. No need to apply any mascara. Since these are going to be on my eyes for about two to four weeks, I do want to keep them clean. Right here are the finishing results, and I am very, very happy. A little slow-mo for you guys. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll drop my social media down below, and I'll see you guys in my next video.